Hello! Today we are going to be examining protists under our microscope. We will complete the protist microscope lab from the Kingdoms and Classification Unit from the Good and the Beautiful. Many, many protists can be found in a single drop of water. So let's see what we can see today through the eye of our microscope. For this experiment, we will need a cup of water from a stagnant pond or lake and microscope slides and covers. I will start by placing one drop of pond water on the slide. Now I will gently place a cover slip on top and dab any wet edges with a paper towel. Okay, that looks good. Now we're ready to see if there are any protists in this pond. What we're really looking for in the microscope is movement. Let's see what we can see. Some of the protists you might see are amoebas, which look kind of blob-like, or maybe paramecium, which have a lot of little hair-like structures called cilia. These cilia flutter to help the paramecium move. You might also find a protist called flagellate, which are long, skinny protists that move by whipping their tail back and forth. If the pond you get water from is stagnant, you might also find green algae protists, which will have a distinctive green color. Can you see any of these protists I mentioned in our sample? If you try this one at home, you may be able to observe completely different protists than the ones that live near me. Thanks for joining me today.